Absolute Value by Aaron Silvis and Maya Garan. This is a number line. It shows integers. Integers include the whole numbers and their opposites. The arrows at the end of a number line show that the number line goes on forever. This number line represents the number 5. Five has an absolute value of five because it is one, two, three, four, five units away from zero on a number line. This number line represents the number negative five. Negative five also has an absolute value of five because it is one, two, three, four, five units away from zero. We say negative five and five are opposites. Opposite numbers have the same absolute value. Absolute value is shown using these bars. So this is read the absolute value of three. And this is read the absolute value of negative three. That's right. You read it the absolute value of negative six. When solving these problems, they may look something like this. You would write, the absolute value of negative seven is equal to seven. Try these. Ready to check your work? The absolute value of four is four. The absolute value of negative eight is eight. And the absolute value of negative two is two. How did you do? Want to try a challenge? What has an absolute value of nine? Think you know? Remember, absolute value can be a representation of distance from zero. Both nine and negative nine have an absolute value of nine. So if the absolute value of x is equal to nine, then x is equal to nine, or x is equal to negative nine. Got it? Let's try one more. My number is larger than yours. Yeah, but mine has a greater absolute value. What could their numbers be? One possible answer could be two and negative seven. Do you know why? Well, two is greater than negative seven since it's farther to the right on the number line. But the absolute value of negative seven is greater than the absolute value of two. Let's take a closer look. 2 is 2 units away from 0, so we say it has an absolute value of 2. Negative 7, on the other hand, is 7 units away from 0, so it has an absolute value of 7. Since 7 is greater than 2, the absolute value of negative 7 
is greater than the absolute value of 2. Let's recap. Absolute value can be thought of as the distance from zero on a number line. The absolute value notation is bars. So this is read the absolute value of negative three. The absolute value of negative three is three. Since negative three is one, two, three units away from zero, on a number line. And that's it. Now you're an expert in absolute value.